This video is a presentation about performing the speech evaluator role at an Agra Speakers Club meeting. In this video, the preparation and goals of the speech evaluator are described and a few other details that can assist when performing this role. The speech evaluator role is at the intermediate difficulty level. It requires 20 to 30 minutes of preparation time and the speech evaluator speaks for four to six minutes during the meeting. And this role is evaluated by the general evaluator of feedback. The role of the speech evaluator is important in public speaking clubs. Evaluators provide feedback and comments for improvement to assist the other participants. The goal of a speech evaluation is not to evaluate the speaker from the viewpoint of some academic or professional criteria, but is to give your opinion on the speaker and the speech from the viewpoint of an audience member. Remember also that as an evaluator, you are merely expressing your own opinion. In AGRA speakers, all speeches must be evaluated. That is a key element on how we learn to improve our communication and leadership skills. AGRA is, above all, an educational organization. There's absolutely no point to give a speech in a club unless it is for the speaker to learn something or to improve in some way. Learning requires an outside point of view since we're usually very bad judges of our own performance. You have three primary goals as a speech evaluator. The first goal is to motivate the speaker. All speakers value being recognized and encouraged by pointing out the positive things they did. The second goal is to educate the speaker and the audience. This is where you point out what could be improved and why this is important. The third goal is to help the speaker improve. To do this, you can provide specific and actionable advice on what, in your opinion, could have been done better or differently in order to improve the effectiveness of the speech. What to do as an evaluator before the meeting. To be effective as an evaluator, you need to know about the person that is going to deliver the speech and the project itself. Before meeting the meeting, try to do the following steps. Read the project description that the speaker is going to deliver. Pay attention to the learning goals and the key objectives of the project. When considering the context of the speech, it includes things like the project objectives, the venue, and perhaps even the day of the week and the time of the day at which the speech is being presented. In addition, consider the level of the speaker, since experienced speakers usually like to receive more suggestions for improvement, while novice speakers need more encouragement and only a few tips for improvement. Contact the speaker before the meeting if possible and ask if there is anything in addition to the project goals that the speaker would like you to pay attention to. Plan your evaluation by remembering that an evaluation is also a speech in itself and it should have all the attributes of a good speech. Make note of anything that can save you time when writing down your impressions during the speech. This will allow you more time to concentrate on the speech while it is being presented. During the meeting, as a speech evaluator, you will be usually asked by the meeting leader to speak two times, once before the speaker speaks and once after the speaker has presented their speech for you to present the evaluation of the speech. When you speak before the speaker presents, your goal is to explain to the audience what project the speaker is doing, what are the learning objectives and goals, and what the audience should be watching for. 
You can also finish with an encouraging remark for the speaker. Sit with the audience so that you will experience what the audience sees and how they perceive the speech. Remember that as an evaluator, you are a member of the audience that has been given the opportunity to make your views known when you present your evaluation. To evaluate a speech, you have to listen to it very carefully. Watch for the aspects of the speech you will be considering in your evaluation. Avoid all other possible distractions and concentrate on the speech being delivered. Take notes of any elements of the presentation that were well done or were not great. While you are taking notes, decide also on the importance of each item you noted down. You may not have time during your evaluation speech to say everything that you wrote down. So it's a good technique to assign an importance number to your points and then quickly note an outline of the things you want to say about the speech during your verbal evaluation. After the speaker has presented their speech, you will be asked to present your evaluation of the speech during the time allocated on the meeting agenda. A recommended approach for delivering an evaluation speech is called the sandwich technique. It combines a layer of positive feedback about what you liked, then a layer where you offer suggestions for improvement, which is followed by a conclusion about what you liked the best about the speech. Presenting positive feedback is usually the easiest part, but try not to provide only positive feedback as this offers no assistance on where to improve, which is the reason people come to Agra speakers. When presenting feedback for improvement, remember that you're not scoring the speaker, but merely expressing your own opinion and offering advice on how to improve. In order to be useful, the points for improvement must be specific and provide guidance on something that is practical for the speaker to do. The conclusion of the evaluation should summarize again the positive points, the points for improvement, and end up motivating and encouraging on a high note. Try to avoid using cliches, and in particular, try not to say, I look forward to your next speech, which is used too often. Try to be creative. Plan for the conclusion even before the speech. After the meeting, talk to the person you evaluated to see if they have any doubts or questions. Also, remember to fill in the evaluation card for that project and give it to the speaker. And here is a tip to help you practice speech evaluations. During a meeting, do the steps that an evaluation requires and make your own notes. Then compare your evaluation to the one delivered by the appointed evaluator at the meeting. This is a great way to practice and learn. Thank you for your interest in learning more about the role of the speech evaluator in Agra Speakers International. You can find more information about the speech evaluator role in the Agra Speakers International site found at the link shown on the screen or in the description below this video. Our mission statement is that Agra empowers you to become a brilliant communicator and a confident leader who will actively build a better world. We wish you all the success as you continue your journey with Agra Speakers International.